The original Cine Capri opened on April 1st, 1966. The first movie ever to play in the Cine Capri was The Agony and the Ecstasy, starring Charlton Heston. The most famous feature film ever to play in the legendary cinema was Star Wars, which ran for a whole year with each show nearly sold out. In 1988, the theater was renovated and reopened by its new operator and owner, Parkins Theaters. On January 5, 1998, at 2.12 a.m., the curtain lowered on the original Cine Capri and its appropriate final film, Titanic. Six weeks later, the theater was demolished. In 2003, the Cine Capri was rebuilt as a part of the Scottsdale 101 Theater Complex in Phoenix, Arizona. With a 568-seat auditorium and a 40,000-watt, 150-speaker digital surround sound system, along with its massive 70-foot wide by 30 feet high screen, Experiencing the true power of the Cine Capri will surely become a memory one will never forget. The Scottsdale 101 location houses a museum that showcases memorabilia and photos of the original Cine Capri. This is the Cine Capri Museum. It's the original Cine Capri that they tore down in 1998. Other Cine Capris across the nation have opened up in states such as Oklahoma, Colorado, Texas, and California. Due to the success of the Cine Capri in Scottsdale, a second Arizona Cine Capri was built in Tempe, Arizona. It has 604 seats instead of 568 from Scottsdale 101, but still has a similar sound system. For 75 years, the Harkin Theaters establishment has entertained us with huge blockbuster hits and memorable movie moments, and will do so for many years to come. <laughs>